This morning, L.A. Mayor Eric Garcetti is among those remembering Archbishop Desmond Tutu. He died yesterday at 90 years old. He is best known for his work as an anti-apartheid and human rights activist. ABC's Lindsay Davis has the latest. He will be remembered as a man of peace, even though Bishop Desmond Tutu spent most of his life fighting inequality, poverty, and injustice. As a child, he lived under white South Africa's brutally enforced segregation. It was his tireless anti-apartheid activism that first propelled him into the international spotlight. As an Anglican bishop, he appealed to the world's conscience from a global pulpit, calling for an end to the violent apartheid regime. This march is going to be peaceful, isn't it? His protests were both hard-hitting and non-violent. He was the first to campaign for economic sanctions. Tutu encouraged disinvestment. In 1985, when the U.S. and U.K. stopped all investments in South Africa, it crippled the South African economy, forcing the government's hand to reform. When the international community awarded him the Nobel Peace Prize in 1984, he accepted on behalf of a movement. On behalf of those committed to the cause of justice, of peace and reconciliation everywhere. That signaled the beginning of the end for apartheid. Free elections were held in 1994, and at 63 years old, Tutu cast his first vote. He then set the bar even higher and served as the chairman of the Truth and Reconciliation Commission, a group created to probe human rights violations during apartheid. In 2009, we saw Tutu's signature smile as he received the Presidential Medal of Freedom. Desmond Tutu possesses that sense of generosity, that spirit of unity, that essence of humanity that South Africans know simply as Ubuntu. The world came to know him as a voice for the oppressed. That voice will live on. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Get more great ABC7 content by clicking the subscribe button for our YouTube channel. And download the ABC7 Los Angeles streaming app on Fire TV, Android TV, Apple TV, and Roku to watch on your TV.